I can remember the blitz because when we could see across to Liverpool, the whole sky was alight with the fires. It was really terrible. The bombs were terrible in the May Blitz of 1941. So we were only six, but I can remember they were all bombed. They didn't know where to go, what to do, and they just said to everybody in the street, come with us, we'll get to Formby. We've got friends in Formby. Nobody had phones in those days and the trains weren't working. How they got there, I just do not know. Well, I was evacuated with um, five or six boys. You see bomb sites when you were come, you know, um, especially in what, one, one part, because um, we came back by coach and um, the, you know, all the places that had been damaged in the war, but where I lived wasn't damaged. No, thank God. <laughs> The bomb came down, we heard it coming, it screams when it comes down and it missed our shelter by two or three feet and it went so, the soil was so soft it went very far down and blew us up in the air and we came down on, our, on the side of the, ton, of the shelter and my father was moaning and groaning but we were all, everybody else was all right. I was in the at sea four years, and which was your apprenticeship. I looked up, and there I could see the outline of America. On the port side was Virginia, on the starboard side was Maryland, and I made a crossing. I was a seaman. But my dad fed for me to be truthful during the war because it was absolutely. You know, we're off bottom as regarding food. We'd made, Dad had made all the cellars into another butcher's shop. And what we used to do, we still had that 13th pig that wasn't too well. And he'd bring it home and we'd butcher it down there, make all little pork joints, wrap them up in newspaper, two big baskets. And then what we would do, Dad knows, knew the houses that were struggling with children. And what he would do, he'd stop outside, pitch black, and I would run up. The, the front garden, knock on the front door, put the parcel down, run back, get into the car and to the next part. And Dad did that throughout the whole of the rationing, feeding for me. <laughs> 